Powered by WCTV.TV. Eyewitness News at 6 starts now. The fight against COVID-19 ramps up. South Georgia Medical Center receiving its first shipment of the Pfizer vaccine. We're in Belgaza, a doses are administered. Plus, a new coronavirus relief bill expected to be passed in just hours in Washington. We'll talk to local businesses that say they're in need of another round of relief. But first, this FDLE raid on a whistleblower's home now the subject of a lawsuit. The scientists targeted saying it was a sham and her rights were violated. Thanks for joining us tonight at 6, everybody. I'm Abby Walton. I'm Eden Schultz. Ben and Julie are off tonight. Former DOH employee Rebecca Jones says in that raid, agents took her phone, her computers, her hard drives, and she wants them back. Capital City correspondent Monica Casey follows this story. Monica, tell us more about today's latest development. Well, the lawsuit was filed here in the Leon County Courthouse just before 8 o'clock last night. It names FDLE Commissioner Rick Swearingen and two of his agents. Sorry. Who else is in the house, man?